What's up everyone, just doing a bit of video editing using the Adobe Creative Cloud software suite using Adobe Premiere Pro so what I do is I find a, a clip that I want to keep, a little bit I want to keep, so I hit the in marker hit play get it to where I want to finish, let it run for a little bit me and the daughter having a bit of a chat she's pointing at something, we're talking about something that's enough. And hit this guy here, so I've got this little bit. That's the part I'm going to keep. Then I hit this, and you'll see it'll get boom added onto the timeline. So, a bit of video editing. That's what I do. Yep, pretty sweet. Nice. Tonight, I am Batman. I am Batman. <coughs> Jesus. I'm Batman. Pack Batman. Batman's packed. Hey everyone, welcome to another training vlog, training video. This is actually going to be a full week of training. So you get all three sessions, start of a new training cycle. So we're on to some new exercises too, some things that I've never really done before and a little bit of variety, something different. Always good to test the body. You can see there, this is one of the different ones doing snatch pulls. First one was flat on feet, second second rep was up on toes and then the third one was a high snatch pull um, Monday night this is the session my daughter was in so she can see she's doing quite well still working from just you know just around the knees there not quite on to full snatch yet but she's definitely getting more confident techniques really good she's got yeah confident under the bar that's always uh, I think an issue with people who are starting out is it's a bit daunting just to throw a bar straight above your head and yeah I think people are worried about it dropping on you but no it won't long, not as long as you coach properly too I think uh, a good coach goes a long way well actually it's critical very very critical uh, well on to back squats this is actually uh, a set of five at 170 I don't think I've done 170 for five before I would actually have to go through and search through my training diary to find out the legs feeling pretty strong. Yeah, there was a lot of volume in this session tonight. It uh, really did uh, take a few days to recover from this. I we after this I had push presses. Don't know what happened, but on one of the last sets there, just before I didn't actually record it, and something happened. I got a bit of pain just on top of the kneecap, like the patella tendon. So I just sort of pulled it up short, finished up early got through most of the sets but didn't want to risk it as you can see there's my daughter hitting some uh, overhead squats this is a, a pb for her she'll probably be pbing every week as she gets right into this program and she's absolutely loving it so yeah that was a monday night training session <sighs> hey everyone wednesday night training session it's been a hot day but look at that it's all coming down all gray it's starting to cool down so training won't be so hot tonight. Knees feeling, yeah, not too bad. I had a really good roll out today. Um, really try to get some of those knots out of the muscles. But uh, yeah, should be pretty good. We got some cleans in that tonight. So I hope the, the knee's all right. I don't know what it was that what happened, but yeah, we'll give it a go. Take it easy, play by ear. Okay, on to Wednesday night training. The knee was feeling a bit better. This one's three position clean, so off the floor, Next one's just below the knees and then above the knees and then on to, we did a jerk straight afterwards as well, was the bars on the chest after the third rep. This next exercise you're about to see is clean pulls, sort of floating clean pulls, so the bar won't touch the ground. Spoke to Coach Linz about this and what it does is it creates extra time under tension, works the posterior chain because the lowering phase is controlled instead of dropping it just like you would in a normal clean pull. So yeah, no, definitely killed, but yeah, good to see. This is a Wednesday night after training. Bit of a stir fry put together with some coconut cream, Chinese cabbage, veggies, curry paste, yellow curry paste, chicken. I thought I'd show you, this is what I have every night. A couple of magnesium tablets, uh, fish oil, I'll grab some more, didn't grab enough, and a multivitamin. That's every night. That's dinner tonight, yum yum. 
on to the last training session for the week. Uh, so we've got power snatches up first. Haven't done power snatches or power cleans in quite a while, but the bar felt really good coming up off the floor. Slow motion. There we go. Bang. Up. Really happy with that. Um, I've been sort of doing more full movements, just to, I think probably just to protect the knee a little bit better too. But, you know, that went quite well. On to one of my favourites. High snatch pulls. High. So getting that bar up nice and high. 90 kilos. Feeling pretty good. And on to the last exercise for the night was supposed to be snatch push press for a set of five with an overhead squat at the end. But unfortunately, battery goes flat now. Well, that's another week done and dusted. I want to thank you everyone for watching the video and for all your support. Um, don't forget to hit that thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Feel free to write any comments in the section below. I do, do read them all and I do reply to everything. And hit that subscribe button. I will be releasing videos every week. Big announcements coming up soon, so you want to keep up to date with that. So, once more, thank you for watching and have a good week. And remember, you're never too old or never too young to lift. Catch you all later. Bye.